Wait, did Z-Minus actually send you like a, like a selfie? Did you like go in his bathroom and take a bathroom selfie? This was from a while ago. My man looks well, you just like... Took a bathroom my man looks found. like he's tired of everyone's shit. In this picture. I mean, anyway, I had like... I had Winter like three blocks. Poke really? Lamb versus Big Boy. Take it away, guys. Um, so I'm not sure. Too. Yeah, and, and I'm not sure, like... If this guy is a mixed C disciple, he's not mashing hard enough to be a mixed C disciple. So, <laughs> uh, because I'm used to seeing all these Falcons in his chat. But, um, looks like he's not. It looks, looks like his face is away from the controller right now. Yeah. Oof. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. hard to mix up. <laughs> Alright, nice start. Yeah. Wow, what? 31? Wait, wait, how did- When did he chop down that tree? Did, 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 did he just turn and chop down that tree? I guess he <gasps> did- Oh my god! I know! Yo, Louis D is good. The look, look, the look on the sub, man. What? Oh, that was a tree. I think? No, the knee hit the gyro. I had the gyro again. Never seen that interaction before. Up smash coming out from big boy. I see let that stop. Oh! Uh, uh, <laughs> Don't taunt and you ran into the tree, bro! <laughs> you taunted and then landed into the tree! <laughs> oh, he's definitely not an exceeded type. Oh man. What is happening? He's like, come on! And then Pokelam's like, alright. He's coming. <laughs> he's like, you got it. Yo, Pokelam! <gasps> Uh, yo, if he look, all I'm gonna say is if he got that again, you would have you actually got that stream, and you died for that. Oh. Now it's you know what? Now it's a close game. Yeah, Honestly, I think Pokelem got a little too confident there, going off stage. I don't think Big Boy's really afraid to approach. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I'm, he haven't. I don't know. What he's doing. He hasn't been um, approaching a lot. Kind of been on the other side of the stage, kind of afraid to do anything, and you guys beat. Interesting. Interesting game. How long was that game? Like two minutes? Less than two minutes? I don't even know. I don't know what happened. I don't know what he was doing here. Like, yeah, I, are, you trying to bait, are you trying to bait him or something? Like, I'm not. I have no clue. I think. Here's my thing. Um, I can understand not approaching Villager when he has Tree, because obviously that can be very intimidating. But at the same time, if the tree is disappearing, then there's no there's no point in really just jumping in place. You can dash forward and get your damage. But I guess I guess he was unaware. Yeah, I don't know what I didn't know what was happening there. Like he was stalling and then also not approaching. I don't know, man. That shield brick was something. Yeah, I know he messed up his drift, but like this this whole thing, him doing this, I don't know why he was doing that. That would have been a good drift though if he made it back. Yeah, it would have been. But still execute it well, unfortunately. Alright, game two. Right now we have, uh, I'm assuming a PS2 run back or a Kalos? Yep, Kalos. Yep. Yep. This is, a, this, is, this, is, this is a Falcon special, man, I'm telling you. He's gonna be able to avoid a lot of those uh, cannonballs by doing the wall jumps, so you have that benefit. No longer okay. dying so many edge guards. Oh, wow, yeah. okay. Yeah, and I respect him going deep for that. His Oh, uh, no wall jump? Okay. And he didn't, like, he didn't overextend initially when he went out, and then, um, Pokemon kind of just... And, and, I, and I'm kind of liking the patience coming out from Pokemon. He, he hasn't really been... He hasn't really been instigating a lot of the offense. It seems like he's just been letting Big Boy come to him. Yeah, certainly. It's like he's letting Big Boy make the mistake and then punish him for it. Yeah. Oh, 
Wow. That whip or something. Yeah, no, nice work, fast punish from the from big boy. Yeah, and that and that brief pause from big boy. <laughs> I feel like that was his uh, his way of being like, okay, I need to take a breath right now. Calm down a little bit. Wall jumps. And you know, that was kind of risky coming out from Pokeline, where in the previous game when he did that, he got punished really hard for that. Yeah, that's a shield grab. Yeah, you got I'll get hit by this again. Yeah, hit by it again. Oh. <laughs> Another tree. <laughs> yeah, hit by it again. That was a cool double parry by um, Big Boy, but... Okay. Yeah, like, yeah, also I'm just holding, oh, like, you're holding back. Actually, doesn't really have to commit to anything at this point. He's in such big a lead. Yeah, just taking them from left to right, man. He really just has the, he has the pace of the bats in his hands. It's like whenever he wants to to get the hit, he goes for it. And then whenever yeah. Big Boy goes for the hit, Big Boy is just ready. Is that trip oh. turn up off the ledge? Is that trip turn up off the ledge? Is that what just happened? I guess so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that. Oh man. I don't care. He just SD'd. He's like, I don't care. I won this. It's old. Yeah, man. Um, it's really weird. I just feel like um, Big Boy tried two different things. In game one, Big Boy was like actually being really reserved and wasn't really approaching Pokelam at all. Uh, where in game two, he kind of just ran into everything. So <laughs> I feel like he's just trying to find this... Uh, this happy medium in trying to approach Pokelem and uh, neither of those things have been working. So let's see if um, Big Boy could make an adjustment going into game three and maybe pull off a reverse 3 0. Sorry about that mic noise. Okay, ZSS is on deck. Trying something different. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Close range only? Okay. So, right here, ZSS has a lot of good options using the Zare to kind of zone out Villager, but also having the choice to kind of uh, dash back and forth and jump to platform safely without the worry of getting caught in disadvantage. She is a little bit on the lighter side. Having the flip kick on deck is definitely going to help in this matchup. But that said, uh, hopefully I'm really just gathering all this damage. Yeah. 
When you're in weird scenarios like that, it could go either way. Surprise that down smash. Yeah, that up smash is also a really good as well. Not gonna do it quite yet. Oh, that was a brilliant game. That was a brilliant game. Yeah, at this at this point, it's big boy really just has to commit. Ah, jeez. Yeah, there, there's nothing much, but boy really did there to keep the pressure on. A lot of dash ins, not enough nears, and then when he overcommitted to that up smash, it just didn't work out. I would have loved to see more out of shield stuff. That said, though, good stuff to Pokemon. Dominating 3 0.